Hey guys, welcome back to Pandas Data Diaries. Uh, today I want to show you how to build a time-based heat map in Tableau. For this purpose, I already loaded this mock data file here, this mock data set, which contains events. So we have uh, event ID, we have start date, and we have the expected participants count for the event. And the only important thing over here is that for the start date, we have a date time field. You see this um, via the icon, which is the calendar and a small clock over here here. So it has the date part and has the time part. We need this for the visualization. Okay, and now let me open a worksheet, an empty one, and let's start building the visual. So first of all, I need to drag the start date in the columns, and I need to do this twice. I will show you why. So let me first of all change the formatting over here. And here's the important part. We do have um, two different date sections in Tableau or date time sections. So the upper section, which is the date part only, and the lower section, which is the complete date. And for this visual, we will need to use the upper part. So let's um, first of all change the first date field to um, month date here. And the second part, like the second date field, to um, the weekday. And we will already have a nice overview over here. So it shows the date and it shows the weekday below. Okay. And now, interestingly, we need to also um, drag the start date to the row section. And here, um, it's a little counterintuitive because usually you might think you want to drag it from here, from the full date part, but you actually only need the date part. So also for the hours, um, go to the date part section and drag in the hours. So over here. And this is already the visual that we would like to see. If you have missing values in between or missing um, time slots, you can just hit right click over here and say, show missing values. And now it's filling up the empty slots as well. So that's great. And we also would like to display the expected participants count, of course. So I can just double click over here. It's adding it. It's also adding in the color and um, also display the label. Just show mark labels over here. And you see, we already see everything nice in the overview. So um, the only thing that we might want to add from a formatting perspective is, um, let me right click over here and say format worksheet. Um, we would like to add these lines here, the row dividers. I can do that via um, the border section. And here we have row dividers. And um, let me change the color maybe a little bit, make them a little darker. And also, for them to be displayed, I need to change the level here to one. And you see, it just dragged in the row dividers over here. So here we have a real nice overview um, on the events, what's happening on each day, and the participants count in this time-based heat map. That's all I want to show you for today. Thanks for watching, and see you soon again on my channel.